If I hadn't paddled around the point in that exact moment, it's a miracle, that's what it is, and I don't believe in miracles. In 1987, I pulled an eight-year-old kid out of the surf. A few years later, I discovered our journey together was far from over. How's your father? He wrote me a letter a few years back. So what'd he say? I don't know. Never opened it. Jay's looked up to you his entire life. Can't you see how much he needs you? Be advised, there's an extremely high surf advisor in effect. You ever see something and you think it's the reason you're put on this earth? What are you talking about? The biggest wave in the world. Mavericks, it's real. I want to ride that wave. Untrained boys don't step in the ring with Mike Tyson. That boy's going to surf that wave, even if he dies trying. I mean, wouldn't you? I'm going to train you to survive, because I don't want it on my conscience. Do you want to get out there? You better be prepared. A wave like Mavericks will hold you down for minutes at a time. If you can't hold your breath for at least four minutes, then you may as well not even paddle out. You know what? I'm not even going to acknowledge that just happened. I'm swallowing water. You've got two more minutes. Clean up that driveway. Hey. Mavericks, man. You gonna slay that dragon all by yourself, or is your rent a dag gonna help you out? What's going on inside of you, Jay? What are you afraid of? You get a chance to change everything. Take it. This is about more than just surfing. It's about the choices you make in life. It's about finding that one thing that sets you free. You gotta be kidding me. You need to believe in yourself, or none of this matters.